Well, I thought there were, there were a number of positives in the game against Milwaukee. We, we held the ball better than we did the, than we have the entire season. Uh, create, continue to create chances. Uh, unfortunately, we only took advantage of one of them. Um, on our corner kicks, we were a bit unlucky a couple of times. I thought we got had some good service, some good runs. Just sometimes the way corner kicks are, you, you, you get good contact on the ball and it hits somebody. And, and that happened a couple of times. And um, I think we played well enough to get a couple more goals, but unless you actually take advantage and make them happen, you don't get them. Um, Milwaukee took it to us at the start. Uh, we were able to battle back, again, showing some resilience that this group has, tie the game up. Uh, but we weren't, weren't able to make that final play, and to Milwaukee's credit, they did. And, and in that sense, that's, that's a bit of the negative still is, you know, previous five games, we were making the plays to get the ties or the wins. In this game on Saturday night, we created the chances to make them, but Milwaukee took advantage of their couple of chances and made them. Well, just from the most basic concept, it's a conference game. Uh, and then on top of it, you got two conference teams. I think we're only about six or seven miles apart total. Um, again, another set of rosters that has a lot of guys that have, co have played against each other. Uh, Coach Eitz and I have coached against each other since I came into the league in 05. So there's a very good rivalry on a number of levels. Um, not having the stats right in front of me, but I think even down to the spring games, it's probably four wins, four losses uh, for both sides. It's, it's a tight rivalry. It doesn't matter the talent level, uh, whether it's even, whether it's different. It always becomes a very, very intense game, and every year seems to have a big impact on the Horizon League standings. Well, I think one of the things that they present is something they've presented every year. Every year they get better as the year goes on, and this year is no different. Uh, they're a very disciplined group, uh, very good on their attacking and defending set pieces, and are good enough to nip you from the run of play if you fall asleep. And so our biggest challenge on, on Wednesday is going to be having to make sure we are focused, in tune, and outwork them. And then hopefully at some point some of our special players can take advantage either on a set piece or from the run of play and make one more play than they do.